The suspect in the college student massacre was back in court today. Brian Koberger made a second court appearance in Moscow, Idaho. He's charged with murdering four University of Idaho students. J. Kerr Alexis was in the courtroom during Koberger's status hearing today and joins us now from Moscow. Jake, what came out of the hearing today? Hannah and Brian, today's hearing was pretty quick. It was around 10 minutes between the time Brian Koberger entered the courtroom and when he left. The biggest takeaway is that there will be a preliminary hearing here in Moscow on June 26th. The courtroom was crowded, but it was mostly filled with media. There were no family members of the victims there. Koberger was calm, and most of what we heard from him were one-word answers. His defense attorney did most of the talk talking and he didn't look at the audience. Koberger waived his right to a speedy preliminary hearing today. Then I will ask at this time as to the five counts, felony counts that were charged in the uh, criminal complaint that was filed on December 29th of 2022. Are you waiving your right to a speedy preliminary hearing and agreeing that that hearing can be held outside the 14 day period? Yes. That means he gave up his right to have the preliminary hearing within 14 days of his arrest. This decision will give his defense team more than five months to build their case. During that June hearing, we could get more information about the investigation. It's expected to last three to five days. Koberger is being held in Latah County Jail without bond after he waived his right to a speedy preliminary hearing today. His defense lawyers were given the opportunity to ask for anything else, including a bond posting, but they declined. In Moscow, Idaho, Jake Carol Alexis, Fox 13 News.